Yeah. The mom and the daddy are tired. <laughs> but we're about to go out with these kids while we're here, okay? And it's cold here. It was not good to me. I would've gotten to bed, baby. Daddy tired too. <laughs> Mechanicals and going down in arcade and stuff. Anyways, we'll see y'all there. Oh, yeah. I have all you. I have all you. Don't be acting strange. Don't be acting like Been entertaining the situation, you know that I've been the only nigga to fuck you this way. You been acting really deep, but you know when I blow that back out. You gon' suck on that ground, got you in my bed, yeah, you know I'm on that ass now. Get that from Atlanta, girl, you know we had to cash out. Now you in LA with your nigga making plans now. Window shopping, she too basic. Came to me for your oasis. Get up, Linda. Next vacation, take tough care, get this thing dry. You on your timeline with a match and brand new. I know your body, I've been on it like a tattoo. You got it fine, you know it, girl, don't blame me. You must be crazy. You must have lost your way. Knew she wasn't mad enough. Oh, my. I can't be a thing. Every time you ride, I know. I know, I know. I'm not going to let her lay me the shame of the way that you move. Hey, y'all. It's the same spot we was in yesterday. We're about to get ready to go get something to eat and then find something to do. In Nashville today, and then we're gonna go to dinner later tonight. It has taken us how many hours to get out of the room? Five. Oh yeah, it's one o'clock. <laughs> Yo, yeah, I have sucked at vlogging. I'm so sorry, but I am drained. Okay. Traveling with your kids. It's a blessing, but deep get on my damn nerve. All right, so we just pulled up to this donut shop. We're supposed to go to Top Golf after this, but. Okay, well, we were gonna try this place, but apparently they are sold out. So, on to the next. <laughs> All right, y'all, we found another location. So we got strawberry fields, Maddie? Um, sticky cheesecake. Sticky cheesecake, vanilla cream. Yes. And Pyrrhus, which is like a regular place one. Five daughters. Mm-hmm. And we just made it to Top Golf. Ooh, ooh. We're about to play. He got a cheesecake. I got one too. Ken's got cheesecake and Bean is sleep. Praise him. <laughs> I think that's an illusion. Ooh, friend. <laughs> I can eat to y'all like that. I had Chris all over my face. I did not wash my face last night, judging mama. But anyways, can y'all see them? Down there in the hot tub. I'ma zoom in all the way as far as this thing. Them three little specks right there on the side. That's them. The daddy is not in the hot tub. They also have a pool and there's people in the pool, but I think the temperature right now is not for a pool. I don't even know if I told y'all because I have not vlogged and I mean I feel like I've been vlogging forever I'm actually tired of vlogging but 
We were originally supposed to go to Destin, Florida, but like, you know, you can only see the weather out so far. A week before we were set to go, we looked at the weather and it's supposed to be colder there than it was in Georgia. And we didn't want to waste our time or our money because we were driving. It was like a five and a half hour drive. We didn't want to waste our time or our money just to go down there and be cold. So at the last minute, we decided to come to Nashville, Tennessee. If y'all are parents, then y'all probably know, taking kids on destinations where it's cold, where you have to constantly entertain them, ain't it. We go to like the beach and the pool, like they can run around, burn up a lot of energy. You don't really have to, baby, I'm ready to go home, okay? My kids have enjoyed themselves and that's all that matters. We got to have our fun when we was in Mexico. Y'all shop is the for sale. I, I went into the store yesterday. We went to Green Malls, Malls at Green Mill, something like that. And I didn't vlog while I was in there because we <laughs> got to talk about it. I love this Laneige stuff. This is, I bought this again. I didn't buy the full size because I still have enough. I feel like will last me until the next Sephora sale. Got the travel size so I don't have to carry the big size around. I think I bought more of the Plum Plum Hyaluronic Acid. I really like this. And if you've never tried the Merit Beauty um, Serum, it literally feels like silk going under your skin. And give you a glow. You can actually use that serum like on top of your moisturizer or before your moisturizer. I did not decide to go down there because I'm very, uh, I get cold very easily. So it would make no sense for me to be down there. And I just needed a moment. The things to do with kids, I feel like it's more so like museums, zoos, different things like that. You can take the kids to like we went bowling on the first night, but the kids have to be gone by nine o'clock because then it turns to 21 and up. It's a lot to do for adults here. I don't see how people travel all the freaking time. Like, I am craving to be at home. I'm craving to go to the grocery store. I just want to go grocery shopping. I want to stock my fridge. I want to get my fresh flowers. I don't want to go back to work. I guess when you thrive off of like some type of routine and like grounding, the traveling, Anyways, y'all, I'm supposed to be here packing, but I've been on TikTok and Instagram. So I'm about to pack up all of our stuff. And I will see y'all when we get back to the house. Okay? Perfect safe travels. Ooh, I thought that was my address. We're back home. I'm gonna wash it and then redo my roots because how long have I had this in? <laughs> Whatever, I was trying to pull my hair up out my face because it need to be washed. It smells like scalp. <laughs> it smells like some, it smells something on there. Maybe it's that. <laughs> anyway, I. One second, guys. Did I show y'all the gin that we bought while we was in Mexico? Can you only get this in Mexico? Anyways, while I was in Mexico, I placed an order for Jack Yay and perfume. On the Sephora app, they released it early. Why are you running? I am her. Mm. Y'all see that? <laughs> That's what the bottle looks like. What do you need, little girl? My socks. Oh, hold on. Your what? I'm afraid on my hand. Mm. I don't know how I feel about it. Did she say this one thing? Come on, Cap. What? It smells like you should. It smells like you should like. Smell it on this finger. It's like a tint of grandma smell, but I knew she was gonna say that, and for that reason, I will be returning. But roses. Yeah, I don't like it. So I, I think it's a really good scent, but it's just one of those things where it, it kind of reminds me of. It's the equivalent to how I feel about Barbary Goddess, where it's just too much for me. I feel like it's I feel like layered with the right thing, it would. <laughs> Layer with the right thing. I just couldn't wear too much of this. I, I personally, I personally don't like it for myself, but somebody else might like it. So she will be returned. Go give me that Sephora bag. Um, and then I also bought some stuff whenever we went to. I'm over there in the, the loft area. 
Did my underwear need to be shaved again? I need to do laser. While we were at Zara, we got stuff for um, the kids, but I got these pants. I don't know if y'all can see me. But they're like the crink some crinkly pants. I just thought these were cute. They have like a button, little detail right here, and then buttons on like the pants of it. And then down here, it's like a super wide cuff with a button right here. Y'all know I showed y'all I had bought this pink tank top, but they didn't have it in a small, so I got it in a medium. I found it in a small at that store. Pink t-shirt to throw on with jeans. <laughs> Let me tell y'all how I'm proud of myself because I came home and unpacked all the suitcases, put on a load of clothes. I have not come down from my overstimulation from this trip. So y'all have to give me a couple days. Anyways, I thought this was cute. Is it given like 90s? No, 70s, 60s? I don't know. This t-shirt, which I thought was cute. And then I got this bag that I thought would be really cute with this t-shirt. But it's like a really cute summer bag. This was, I don't know the price is off of it, but y'all, it's so cute and super detailed. Do y'all see that? The detail on this bag? Y'all can't tell me this ain't gonna be a cute summer bag, okay? <laughs> and then how they say it in Canada, bag. Oh baby, that's cute. Mm-hmm, this would've been cute for vacation. I love the pink. And then I got these jeans in a size two. I normally wear a size four, but I was thinking because they're like, do y'all see the details on them in the front? Since they're like baggy, that these should fit. And they're like wide leg at the bottom. Oh my God, they're so big. I bought this linen scarf because I felt like it would be really cute if I found a swimsuit that was this color. Y'all see that? So imagine I have on a swimsuit and this is just tight right here and then all of that open. This is what it looks like with that. I think it's cute. I didn't really like the price of this. This was $35. Girl, this was $40 for a scarf. So I actually love these jeans, but I just don't like how I don't know, I feel like if styled appropriately, these would be so cute. I just can't get past the fact that these are like balloon open, what's the names right here? They're so baggy. If I, if I get these taken in any type of way, it literally takes away from how these pants are actually intended to fit. Cause I feel like it's giving like a 90s moment with how baggy they are in the back, you know what I'm saying? Especially with the braids. I think that was $45. It's not terrible. $49.90. Maybe that $5 would be making a difference. I don't care what nobody say. Yo. It's Monday. It just turned 10 o'clock. I got out of the bed at 9.05 this morning. Unintentionally. Obviously, I had to be to work. So... I got up at six something to lay Maddie's edges. I didn't even lay my own edges, but I was like, I'm going back to bed because I just can't. And I did not intend on sleeping till nine o'clock. I don't know what it is, but I cannot bounce back. I feel very sluggish, very tired. And like, I just don't wanna do this. So, in other great news, my skin, my skin looks amazing. My eyes look like little sad puppy dogs. Anyways, I'm gonna try my best to try and get some house projects done. I don't really have the energy for it. I don't even have, I'm not even in the mood to do anything home related, but I'm tired of seeing all the decor that I've purchased to do things just sit around. So either I'm gonna finish the project or I'm gonna take the edge back because I'm tired of looking at it. Point blank period, ain't nothing else to it. I'm working, as y'all can see. I am probably about to go fix myself some tea. I'm gonna fix myself some water, take my vitamins, and get my life together. Because right now it's in shambles. Mmm. My skin looks amazing. So yeah, cleaners are supposed to come today. I love it when they leave. I hate it when they come. It also looks amazing when it's done. They're gone. I just don't like them being in my space. Y'all were watching the solar eclipse. This is what it looks like now. You see how dark it is outside? Oh my gosh. Hey y'all, I'm about to get ready to go take Kenzie to her tumbling class. And then I submitted a 
another Sephora order. So we're gonna go pick that up. So this is my outfit that I'm wearing. Warm outside today, actually. This is the two piece set from Amazon that I got a couple years ago. I'll link it if I can. And then just these little blazers. We'll see you lovely in the mall. All right, we're on our way to the mall. I was doing a lot of research on Sephora, um, not Sephora, on TikTok, which is why I submitted another order today. Ooh, that car's smoking like hell. TikTok been having a chokehold. You're like, I need to put some oil on my scalp. The only thing that be on my For You page is dancing, food, and true crime. Is that what you think of me, TikTok? I smell weed. And I need to go to bed at a decent hour. I gotta go in the office tomorrow. And I'm just not trying to be, why is the weed so goddamn loud? Okay, I'm gonna really quickly show y'all what I got because I got 35 minutes and I need to run a whole place. So, hear me out on this, okay? Any given Sunday is the person that actually convinced me to get it, but I've seen several people talk about it. I did some research on it. Even though I may not look like it, she's getting older so i got the double serum clarins double serum hydric and lipid lipidic acid i mean system girl this this is what i got y'all may or may not have heard of it but it's supposed to help with like um anti-aging basically it helps the skin keep looking beautiful okay and that's at this point in my life that's what we're on okay so i got that it was very expensive which is why i decided to go ahead and get it at a discount batteries dying i also got the one size setting spray and then i got the glowy super gel in the color sun glow yeah as like a little you know just to make the skin look a little bit glowy. and then i got a order that's being shipped to me two orders that's being shipped to me my original one that i was telling y'all about and then the one that i recently just did. anyways, I'm finna run to Whole Foods. I'm gonna pick up this child, and I will probably talk to y'all tomorrow after work. Okay, good day. I said I was gonna see y'all tomorrow, but I went to Whole Foods. Got some cantaloupe, mangoes, green beans, some strawberries, titars, quick the titars, onion, avocado, <laughs> strawberry, banana, yogurt for breakfast. Dairy free milk, so that or dairy free heavy whipping cream, so I can make me a cream smoothie. Salmon and pico. I probably have to add some lime to this if it's not limey enough. But this is for my snack. And I just have some more yogurt in there. So we're about to cook it in. Like it. Hey friends, I just got home from work. I don't like to have that sound, but actually today was the best in office experience I ever had. You know why it was? Because I changed my outlook. A negative outlook means a negative outcome. And we had to change it up. I bought this, I told y'all this salsa yesterday. Baby, it ain't got nobody flavor. It's just the, it's just everything you see in here individually flavored. We about to, we, 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 we. We about to add some flavor. I got me a lime. I'm about to go get the one I took to work mixed back in here so I can eat it again. I think it just ain't got no salt and no lemon juice. So we about to add it all. We got a little bit of salt, garlic powder, onion powder, light purple, and some crushed red pepper because we want it to be a little bit spicy. I think there's some jalapenos in here already. Mm -hmm. Baby. <laughs> If you got Whole Foods and you like Pico, now this was probably like $6. I don't know how much it was. But yeah, you just gonna have to dock it up and let you find what flavorless. So last night I was in the process of recording myself cooking dinner and then I got interrupted because I was on the phone. Yes, I will get you a cover. Oh my gosh, let me get you the cover. Friend, friends. So I just got finished recording this little, um, the ending. Girl, why the light don't work? Anyway, it said my support package is here. Watch that and send it to the oh, it's on the porch. Please help. Y'all know I went into the office again today. Didn't complain not one time. Now when I got in there this morning, I was sitting at that table like Lord. I think this is the original order that I submitted. 
goodies. I'm so excited. I am so excited. Let me take a picture. I don't know why I take so many pictures of stuff. I never post it. Anyways, this is not mine. Tower 28, got this for Kenzie. My hourglass. And I was like, oh, I wish my, um, hold on y'all. Did though. Um, I wish my stuff would come because I feel like playing a makeup. I really do. Most of these are like restocks. So the Honey Girl Oil. Why does camera play so much? I'm just trying to show y'all products and it do not want to show y'all. The Honey Girl Oil, which I use every single day and it gives you that just a nice little glow. I don't have this on right now. Did I? I actually do have this on right now, but my face is not been through today. I got the travel size of the Laneige Cream Skin Toner and Moisturizer. I showed y'all the big bottle of this, I think. This is the one where I was saying, I think that the formula in this changed because when I was originally looking at this, um, I was like, wait, it doesn't look like the bottle that I currently have. And some people were saying they were using it, they think the what's name had changed. Some people actually broke out from this. So if you're trying this for the first time, I will highly recommend that you do a patch test. It does not break me out. My skin loves it. But I also got more of this. This is my nighttime. What's the name? I also got the travel size of this. This is a restock. I got the big one right now. The big one is sold out. That's the only reason why I didn't get a big one, but I also wanted a smaller one so I could put this as a travel thing. Cause this is, baby, if you got tough skin on your feet this gonna grease you right up i don't like putting this on my body because it's it's very oily got another one of these this is only 70 percent alcohol in here so you touch shit don't put that on your hands thinking it's gonna kill it why does it look like it's open restocked on these because I think they work restocked on these i would i did have like four of these in my what's name but i was like girl you still got two packs in there and they only four dollars and something so do the math if you got 20% off, it, it ain't that deep. What is that, 80 some cent? It ain't even a dollar. And then the Summer Fridays. I told y'all that I was not going to be purchasing any. Y'all, it be looking like there's stuff under my nails, but it's literally the design on the front. I just had to throw that out there. I told y'all I wasn't gonna use this. I mean, get any lip products, but I wanted to try this one. Right now, oh, my skin look a little weird. Right now, I have on the Slicks. Slick slaw, 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 topicals one. I know I told y'all when I first got it, I was like, mm, y'all, I've been on this all week. When I put this on in the morning, my lips still be hydrated by the time I leave. So I'm gonna try this one out. That was mint. But that's all my stuff, that's it. And when the next one get here, I'll show it to y'all. Vlog probably go live about seven, eight o'clock. I might hold off to Thursday, girl. Who knows? Cause it be, I gotta go into the office this morning. I'm proud of myself for making it through the week without complaining out loud. Good morning, friends. Let me turn this down. Girl, so why is it still so rainy outside? It's been rainy all morning. When I tell y'all, this has probably been the absolute worst of my, I ain't gonna say the worst week of my life, but it has not been the best week. Like the amount of days it's taken, I feel like every time I come on this camera, I talk about how I've not been able to bounce back. Can y'all hear me for this dishwasher? But anyways, I got me a souvenir whenever I went to, I don't wanna, I, for some reason I wanna say I went to Texas. I got me a souvenir when we went to Tennessee. <sighs> Isn't she a beaut? I didn't need this, I just wanted it. I just think these are the cutest things ever. I be needing me a little mirror in my purse. I can be like, is my, are my eyes dry? Like, is my skin still, y'all my skin. Oh, so I used the Clarins Double Serum. Last night was the first time I used it again this morning. So I can't really speak on like the benefits of it, but the way it had my skin feeling, I slick didn't want to like it because that is a very expensive habit to form with my skin like if it works and my skin actually likes it to have to pay 95 dollars every single time so we have to use that sparingly but i feel like the benefits are good like i said it's anti-aging so <laughs> y'all see that but yeah this is so cute and i'm gonna put it down on my little purse i'm about to change over to my little coach bag i got this from the coach outlet last year you put the last girl i don't know oh and i tried the um um Summer Fridays, the green mint one, the vanilla, and the mint, we can be besties. So we just gonna put her over here in this little slab part, girl. 
and it came with this little cover. Oh my gosh, speaking of, when I went in there, I met my bestie, Justin. He's my bestie just because he's gay and I always wanted a gay best friend before. I don't know, I just feel like there's so much fun, so much personality, just full of life, you know what I'm saying? So anyways, Justin gave me some samples. Why y'all ain't tell me she no chance and so good? It's just so like clean and similar to how I was describing Miss Dior Bloom Bouquet. It's just clean and just makes you feel just so like clean. I don't even know how to describe it. Baby, that Chanel Chance. The Sephora still still going on. Might have to cop it because it smells so freaking good. Let me show y'all the tea that I've been drinking. Ginger honey and then the lavender chamomile that's a probiotic. I need something to shake because it ain't even about just the bloating as much as it is how it feels it literally feels unhealthy in my gut because what's funny is whole time we was in mexico i had hints of dairy here and there my stomach never once hurt from eating the food my stomach never once hurt as soon as we got to nashville the first meal i freaking had stomach was instantly hurting i was like the u.s gotta do better because why is all of our stuff like just so processed and so many hormones in it that it literally gets your body up instantly? Anyways, let me show y'all my uh, how the skim set fits. I'm gonna get on there and order this too. Oh, girl, this is how it fits. It's super cute. These are big, so I probably should get these in an extra, extra small versus just extra small. But this is what the shirt looks like. This is just an illusion, y'all. My stomach looks flat, but it's really not. Well, when I'm standing up, sit down, it's whole nother level. I just really 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 want to get on my fitness journey and it's just so hard for me like the thought of working out infuriates me it irritates me to my core because i'm just like i'm tired thinking about it and i don't want to be like that but y'all see how swole my face is friend friends Ooh, my face looks a little look a little oily so they have the target red card i have the target red debit card anyways they sent me a new card so I'm cutting up this old one. I used to work at Wells Fargo. So whenever you're disposing of your old cards, you're supposed to cut off, you're supposed to cut it up, right? When you cut it, you cut the last two digits, like cut between the last two digits, that's one card. Cut the first two digits, that's another piece of the card. And then the other piece, you cut down the middle to separate the top half and the bottom half of the numbers. And you end up with four pieces, right? and you dispose of them in two different trash cans. So two of them you put in one trash can, two of them you put in another trash can. So that way, if somebody is going through your trash, they can't just put the pieces of the card back together and steal your money. That is my contribution to society today. Oh, oh the CD, so you can go shopping with me. <laughs> Her, I'm wearing the shirt I showed y'all that I got from Zara. These pants, I wanna say are from PacSun. And then I have on these shoes. And blues don't match exactly, but I feel like it's okay. A little casual look fire, you know? <laughs> Friend, friends. <laughs> so we're headed to Perimeter Mall. I, I went and got y'all a new battery and everything. Not new, but a, a freshly charged battery and everything. I said my friend's coming with me today. Anyways, I'm taking some stuff back to Zara that I showed y'all in the previous vlog. And I also want to look while I'm Zara, you know. Put these little shades on real quick. <laughs> y'all. Oh, I forgot to take my vitamins. When I tell y'all the C vitamins, coupled with obviously me drinking more water, baby, I'm regular. Okay? And that might be TMI for some people, but baby, that's a natural part of life. Red look. Give me my kudos. But anyways, I got sidetracked. My sister told me that I'd be like sleep acting ADD. Cause I just be bouncing around, I can't help it. But yeah, we wanna be in the house this weekend. So I think we're gonna grill this weekend because baby, on Sunday it's supposed to get up to 80 degrees. Tomorrow's be like 70 something. It's gonna be real nice. It's giving, let's run by Home Depot, grab a few flowers, plant them, stage them, get the outside looking its best. Let's be outside, but at the house with it this weekend that's what it's given and i'm so excited about it it's been raining literally all week and i i can't stand it it's affecting my mood you know
good morning friends happy saturday so we're out early well not quite as early as i'd like to it's almost it's actually 11 o'clock now i want it to be out no later than 9 a.m but just been chattering it up with my husband and then my niece today but we're headed to the mall because i've got a little bit to return to sephora also got to run by home deep no not home home good home goods because i want to be able to get me just a cute little tray to hold my fragrances i actually have to go to the grocery store because we are planning to grill out today to be able to celebrate our annie today so it's that annie we're going to go out to dinner but we decided we're not just stay home and celebrate that way so yeah it's a really nice day out 65 degrees now it's supposed to get up to i believe like 73 i'm actually upset because i want it to be out at nine o'clock but because i i don't like the traffic i don't like the ruckus okay i wanted to be out early run my air so i could be back by 12 o'clock and i'm not gonna get to my destination until about 12 o'clock but on a serious note the clarence double serum i can't remember if i told y'all before i know i told my friends on tiktok or some of y'all are my friends on tiktok but i really liked the clarence double serum but by the end of the day i had tiny bumps on my face and i was like nope can't do it that's okay it doesn't mean this is not a good product just because it didn't work for me it's just not for me and i was like you know what i'm gonna stick to what i know so we're headed to get my uh glow recipe plum plump serum she works wonders and she's at the price so i'm kind of excited the double clearance didn't work out the sub double serum didn't work out because <laughs> i would have been scared to use it 95 dollars to re-up no and that's for the little bitty bottle baby you risking your life bright and early on a saturday anyways y'all i'm gonna stop talking so we won't be too chatty in the vlog i will see y'all when we get to the mall okay okay i need some chapstick on so ignore the music but this bag is so cute tell me it's not it's 34 dollars and then i was gonna put this on it let me show y'all tell me this is not cute One thing I do not do is crazy. <laughs> and there's some crazy MFers in there. So I had to get gone. I'll show you guys what I get when I get to the house, okay? This is absolutely positively why I like to come early because everybody and their mom is at this god dang home booth. They got some caraway dupes. Definitely not giving caraway price. Beyonce, look what you done did. <laughs> Cowboy everything, child. Cowboy cheese board. I could use this. So I was thinking about getting this one. I think that's cute. I don't see. I wanted the honeycomb one, but I don't see anymore. Ooh, maybe I need to go to TJ Maxx. Look at these chairs. I'm tired. <laughs> I haven't been out too long. And I haven't eaten. Remind me of my old manager when I used to work at a certain place and I did not like that lady. She was so like rude and condescending. I'm trying to debate should I go inside of TJ Maxx to see if they have <clears throat> Chill, I'm tired. I'm gonna go home. And I'm about to stop by Chick-fil-A and get me a six-cat kid meal. And I ain't bringing nothing home to nobody. Oh! Baby, I am tired. I feel like y'all can't see me with shades on. Oh my gosh. It looks like traffic. So, I showed y'all some chairs. If that color was like espresso brown or something, like they would have been perfect, but it was definitely a moment of me about to sacrifice the vision of what I actually wanted for our um, dining room. It's just based on what I see. My husband was like, mm. oh my God, I still gotta go to the grocery store. 
Maybe I'll feel differently once I actually have something to eat in my system. Baby, it's not your go. Don't play with me. Um, but right now I'm just exhausted. I feel like my entire day has been spent being out. In other news, I had $120 in rewards, but I only used, I probably used half of them. No? Girl, whatever. That's what that leave me with. $40. Hell no. Yeah, I was like, I'm gonna I'm save some for a rainy day, you know? But I don't like using them because the, the thing is, if you use your rewards and let's say some of the stuff didn't work out, they don't give you the rewards back like you lose them. Had I left the house when I had intended to, I wouldn't be having this situation right now. So let's go give me something to eat real quick. Shally, run by this grocery store and take our black asses home. Okay? Good day. What you looking at? I don't want you following them. <gasps> Oh, baby, a Nordstrom rack right opened up. Yeah. Why I didn't get carded when I just went inside the liquor store? I had my ID ready and everything. I said, you know what? I'm going to just say she got distracted with trying to tell me about a restaurant that I don't give two SHITs about. But how about... Hey y'all, I'm home. He's already getting on my nerves. I'm just playing. So let me show y'all what I got. I got the small version of the plates, the ones that are like pink with glitter and the gold around them for Bean's birthday, instead of the big ones. So I'm gonna take the big ones back because these can be used as cake. And there's more in here, there's 24. I got me some more disposable little cups. They have these cute little what's the names on them and they're colorful cups that make me happy. They did have some more bees. They had like oranges and it says, I don't know what it said, but they were like really cute. Also got me this little mirror thing because we broke our mirror and my husband bought him another one. He was like, you need to get your own mirror. I said, okay then, so I found me a pink one. I also found this, which I feel like has something to do with like beach house decor type thing, but I just like the texture of it. And right here I have this pink flower, which she's doing nothing for me. So I thought this would be really cute because it's like plastic on the inside and I actually, I feel like I can put water in here and actually have my tulips coming up out of them, fresh flowers that actually sit over there. I'm over the faux one, so we're gonna get rid of that and put these over there. So we'll style this in just a minute because guess what I got? Tulips! Ah They're so cute. They're giving Easter. They're giving spring. These right here, y'all, are the absolute cutest things ever. The way that I want the decor to work is also be like something functional that they can actually use at the same time. So I got this one to go in Maddie's room, but I don't know if it's actually gonna go with her color scheme. But they actually open up and they can actually be used as cute little um, purses, which I just think is the cutest thing ever. Can you imagine? Oh gosh. And these were only $12.99. This one, this one was $9.99. And this one is like a little house thingy. And you just open it up like this. It's giving the illusion of like a picnic basket or something, but it's not, it's like plastic, if that makes sense. This one was $12.99. Also got this little, what is it called? Mortier mortar whatever to make avocado because my husband always is doing it like in a bowl and i just feel like this will be easier for him but they don't have like they didn't have like bigger ones they had a smaller one that's like a cream color that was really cute but it was way smaller and then i showed y'all this while we were in there but i got this little stand thing to put my perfumes on so i'm gonna take it upstairs to see if it actually will look right or if it's too high but yeah just around that I think it's cute. And that's everything that I got from Home Goods. Let me show y'all really quickly what I got whenever I was at the mall. <laughs> All right, so my Sephora order is just the serum. Can you go look at my drawer upstairs and tell me if that says serum on that little recipe box? And then I got another eyebrow pencil because I thought I misplaced the new one that I bought and then I found it this morning. So I technically don't need this, but this was like $12 with 30% off. I'm not taking it back. And then I got this. I showed y'all this in the dressing room. Y'all, this is so cute. And I this is actually sold separately, but I just added the scarf to it. The scarf actually says vacation on it. But I thought this was just so cute. Like if you think about it, you can use this like a little carry-on to throw all your little stuff in that you need. 
or to take it to the beach if you don't want to carry like a super big one. I think it's so cute. And it actually has a strap for you to carry like as a crossbody. You, you have got to be kidding me. Ish. Anyways, and then I just got this cute little striped shirt. They had some linen pants that would have looked cute, but the pants was too short and I wasn't about to get them tailored and all that. But I just got this cute little basic shirt. You didn't see any boxes inside my what's the name? I got this for work. And then I was about to, I was minding my business. I was getting ready to leave, right? And Forever 21 was sitting right there. And I was like, oh my gosh, that bathing suit is so cute. And then I went in there and I was like, wow, I haven't shopped in Forever 21 since I think I was in college. I've been sleeping on them. Their quality gives me the same as like a pack sun. But anyways, y'all know I love these types of pants. They fit so good. They're so cute. If I can link this stuff, I will. But it's kind of like, it reminds me of Minecraft a little bit. Y'all know I love me a good cargo. And then I got this Pink Floyd t-shirt. I love band t-shirts, even though I don't know anything about the band, but it's like a cute little crop top. The quality of this is actually really, really good. This was $20. The pants were $35. I got this bathing suit cover. Y'all, it looks so good on. I actually got it in a size large, which is kind of big on me, but the way that it sits on my hips, it actually looks good. This was $40. I don't think that's a really good price, but I liked it, so I got it. The swimsuit I got to go with it is a cute little floral swimsuit. I got this in a size medium, and it was only $25. Isn't this cute? And it's very cheeky. Can y'all see, like, the... It's so cute. So I'm gonna wear this whenever we go to Miami or whenever we do like our um, summer vacay. It's so cute. But that's everything that I got, friends. Y'all, this is what it looks like. I rearranged this over here. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh, I love this. And then I just put the restoration hardware books over here and turn them the opposite direction to fill it up. So it's, I feel like a little bit more you know, we got our little tears or whatever, but I think it's cute. Tell me that ain't Kurt. And then we just have this little ball. I pulled this book out because I had opened this book out to go over there, but it didn't look right. It was just too, it wasn't enough space. So put her down because she kind of matches the vibe, yeah? And the hubby made us margaritas for the anniversary. And we're grilling. I'm going to have to show y'all the food because y'all know what's about the butt. The way I look, I should not be coming on this camera. I really came out here to close out this vlog, y'all, and to show y'all something else that I got from Sephora real quick. Not that y'all need to know, but I told y'all I was going to tell y'all everything I got, so I'm going to show y'all everything I got. I look a mess because I feel a mess, and it's Sunday, and it's so beautiful outside, and I'm sick and tired of editing right now. So think about changing my upload schedule, even though I don't ever upload whenever I say I'm going to upload anyways, but to me, that means I'm missing. Anyways, I got this. If we're friends on TikTok, y'all already got to see this. I bought the Exhibit A NARS blush. And me and my sister did this whole plan and makeup thing. We were on FaceTime the other day. And everything I got looks so pretty together. It's this. If you don't have this and you like wearing blush, girl, this one. Or you can just find another red blush. But on the brown skin, the girls on TikTok, they was right. I also got the Danessa Myricks, um Blooming Romance. What's the name, I think? So it's this, it's so cute. Y'all can see I already been like planning and stuff. You use this like to tint your lips, eye eyeshadow, blush, like all of that type of stuff. So I got that. And then I also tried on the tinted moisturizer from Hourglass, the shade 14. The thing about that tinted moisturizer, whenever you first put it on, it looks like it doesn't match, but you have to like, you know, do your thing. And I feel like, was that it? I feel like it was something else. Oh, did I show y'all the Say Glow thing? I already took that back to the store as well as, as well as the Clarins. I think that's everything that I got. But anyways, I'm coming to close with this vlog because I'm sick and tired. I'm tired. I'm just tired. I'm going to go downstairs fix me a drink. Go outside and enjoy this 80 degree weather. I was supposed to do projects and everything, y'all. I didn't do shiznit today. I've literally been in a bed. Because why? I've been up since 4 something in the morning. Can't figure it out. I love y'all. Thank y'all for the support. And I will see y'all in the next video. Whenever that is. We're going to figure it out. Pray for them.